All right, we're going into game one. Looks like small battlefield. Best stage. Oh, no, PS2. Never mind, second best Second stage. best stage. Yikes. It, Devin, PS2 is fine. Get out of here, John. Oh, my God. <laughs> Never. All right, see, really good start from both players. That trample dash attack coming in clutch. Yeah, Palutena definitely has things that no other character can do. Just being able to say no to attacks is... It's really something, I gotta say. It's goddess privilege, I swear. Her back air and her dash attack, trample, trample, trample. All right, missing the Nair. Can't get anything started from that. Ooh! Trying to cover the recovery, but Super Sonic just challenging it anyway. That being said, this can be a tough matchup because Palutena's Nair is normally used as like a a stuffing option. It's like, oh, you're trying to do something? No, here comes my Palutena Nair. Yes. And Ooh. it's not the best option for stopping spin charge and spin attack. Instead, what do you recommend? Losing. Losing, dang. It's a hard matchup for Palu. As we're seeing it now, Super Sonic is, well, 81%, but he's getting some really good extra credit on this uh, second stock. It's hard because, Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Can we clip that? That was ridiculous. It's Got hard you. because every advantage Palutena has as a character, Sonic kind of just doesn't care. Like, Palutena is fast. Yeah. Sonic's faster. Palutena has good stuffing options. Sonic spin attacks don't don't get stuffed by them very well. Right, as we saw there. Oh, trying to dash attack. He did the beefy there, so he wouldn't get punched. Very nice timing. And just like that, even stocks. I see the way two popcorn is playing. They're going to be able to fight back quite well. Hopefully so. What else? Palutena's got projectiles. That's right. She has two projectiles. Sonic don't care about your projectiles. That's right. Sonic doesn't need projectiles. Just has two fists. And legs. They're the longest projectile sometimes. What? No! I, I respect that. For those of you who don't know, if you grab the ledge from above, you can't be two framed. So, Palutena is another teleporter who will try to get above the ledge and teleport to it so there's no two frame. You know, they're invincible, then they're invincible. But you're holding down, so if you mess it up, you're going to go past the ledge and die. Yeah. You know, these tournament nerves really are real. Nice counter. Well, I wouldn't say it's nerves just yet. It is game one after all. Super Sonic just taking blow for uh, blow after blow. Wah! All right, good. We found dash it. Attack. We found the move that beats Sonic's forward <laughs> smash. <laughs> dash attack. There it is. And Palutena's back air. Oh, well, let's see what happens. All right, good grab. Back throw. All right, we out. Doesn't really have much of. Doesn't have much in the way of edge guarding Sonic, sadly. I was about to say, we're not seeing a lot of exploding flame here from Two Popcorn. He was using that pretty liberally against Helper, just trying to get back on stage. Oh, Sonic's more. Okay, the reason for that is that Sonic can do spin shot, you know, thing where he can't. He's dead. Oh, yeah, he jumped. Yeah, he had no choice but to jump when he did, otherwise, he would have been too low to recover, and Spring was there. Very unfortunate. Let's see a replay of that last stock. Yeah. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Right? Okay, let's see here. Yeah, so he Right here, he's like explosive flame, and he's oh. so low. He's so low over there that he has to jump immediately. Mm -hmm. But the spring is like, ah, I'm going to hit you one or two frames after you start that double jump, so you're going to die anyway, idiot. Yeah. I didn't even see the animation for the double jump come out. That was nuts. I mean, it was down there in the blast zone. That's true. My eyes just can't squint that hard. Anyway, one more case for... Uh, Sonic countering Palutena, one of Palu's best options is that. Oh what the my heck God. was that? That was such a bait. Just one holding of, it forever. One of Palutena's best options for stuffing out moves is back air. Unfortunately, it tends to whip against short grounded opponents like Sonic when he's in a ball. Ah, well, it is what it is. Oh boy. So it's yet another point against Palutena in this matchup. Two Popcorn hasn't really been using those forward tilts that helped him out so much either. It's too slow. It's going to be easily be punished. You're too slow. Yeah, unfortunately, that's the reality of this matchup. Too slow. Please bring that taunt back. Taunt should have been online. Changed my mind. I agree. I think Smash 4 had the best uh, implementation. You get two, and then one more for each KO you get. Yes. Just let people taunt. Yeah. It's even worse now because now people just teabag, and that feels even worse than getting taunted. Yeah, I don't have taunts. 
At least taunts are like funny animation in addition to me raging. Yes. Besides, it's part of the mind game, you know? If you're taunting and they're getting tilted, you're winning. I mean, teabagging has the same effect on Sadly. It's just more infuriating. Yes. Especially when it's like a slideshow and it's like, bro, why are you teabagging? Whoa! You have like McDonald's internet. Palutena's dash attack will not go over any of Sonic's ball moves. That is something to keep in mind, too. Oh, take a note. Because Pal Palutena's dash attack can get low profiled by certain things, but not Sonic. Uh oh. All right, two popcorn is still living. Looks like he's learned from his last game. Oh, wow. That's the reason why he's not throwing out a lot of those four tilts. It's just too slow of a move. Yeah, we got masters of the weird moves here. Super Sonic, master of the homing attack, two popcorn, master of the F tilt. Hey, if it works. Look, I like when players have like a signature weird quirky move. It's like no one else uses this, but he will. He will press forward tilt. Because <laughs> it is strong for him. All right, good job of just getting out of the way of that platform, knowing that Super Sonic just wanted to drop down and back air. Oh, that's a, no just enough space. Sonic bounces off the floor. He has to land with a lot of lag, unless he doesn't land. Just never lands. The floor is lava. All right, not a bad trade. At least that's the situation. Oh, that wow. was interesting. I've never seen that happen. The ledge warp? Yeah, she was like at ledge height, but then she clipped over onto the stage. Very interesting. Oh, no. Reversal. Yeah, Super Sonic just reversed that so well. Back here, nice tower shield. Beautiful. Something, ple bleh, something players should be looking for against Sonic. When you're at a high percent, Sonic's going to be doing back airs like he's Wolf. Yeah, just spam it. Wow, what oh. a good scoop from the ledge. And two popcorn is looking very good in this last stock. Not enough. Not enough. Something right. else to, well, I guess not for him. Oh. Oh, he's got those power shields. He learned. All right, the juggles. Hey, Sonic's back air. It has a decent amount of cooldown. If you get that power shield, it's a pretty free punish. Mm -hmm. It's just safe because it has so much block stun. All right, we have no mash. Uh, injured. Not a bad idea. I think he was worried about Sonic forward smash reaching that far off the stage. <laughs> right. Or the four there. Nah, Dropped definitely forward smash. Uh. Wow. Arm like stretches <laughs> out like it's Min Min. Listen, I could see Sonic as a guest character in arms. With a Sonic like outranges Min Min. Oh my god. Did somebody start like a Smash Ultimate minus mod. Christ. That'd be awesome. <laughs> I'd play that. If we fit back exploding breathing. <laughs> Yeah, they could use customs like inform a lot of their decisions in minus. Oh my gosh, please. Ooh. Giant hoops. Alright, here we go. What do we see? It's only planning to try and catch the Alright. Bring back Sonic spin dash burying people. No, please, God. Two spoons takes gain two. <laughs> two spoons? Two popcorn. I guess you can't have two popcorns and two spoons. Sorry, I was I was thinking of uh, I don't know what I was thinking yeah, of. Yeah, yeah, John, elaborate. Maybe I was thinking what of. What were you thinking? Maybe I was thinking of Two Bros Pizza. Ah, uh, Two Bros unfortunately had to raise their that, price recently. That that doesn't explain the spoons though. Do you eat pizza with spoons? Yeah, two spoons. One for All the top, right, one I think for I the bottom. You both of you actually. <laughs> or something like that. Game three. Two popcorns doing a good job of showing. Well, he ain't gonna lose <laughs> so easily. That wasn't really a sentence. Three, that was a sentence. Two, it was grammatically one, correct. It was a meaningless go. sentence. But still a sentence. It is also showing that despite all the uh, disadvantages I listed for Palutena in this matchup, she still does have the benefit of being a good character to help even the odds. Yep. Two popcorn making the wrong decision oh. there. Nice ledge warp. Oh. Oh. I know Sonic was using this to maybe get those, you know, to continue falling in the air with the platforms, but... Oh, that's a punish. Oh, but yeah, two popcorn doesn't know. He doesn't know, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my god, what a catch. I'm not... Oh, what a catch, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think this counterfeit's going too well, huh? Ah, uh, I mean... I don't think any of that was because of the stage. He followed with the platform. I Would guess. not have gotten that up there. I guess so. Uh oh. Ah! <laughs> oh. Okay, so Sonic up smash. Yeah, let's Has talk about eye that. Has iframes. 
Oh, and it's right. Yes, it will clank. I didn't know it had iframes until, like, one of the patches said, oh, yeah, we increased the iframes on Sonic Sub Smash. I'm like, why would you buff him? I was like, it had iframes? <laughs> was that the first patch, too? No, it was the one during COVID. Ah. You know, when they buffed Sonic and Ness during Wi-Fi. Oh, dear lord. Oh, beautiful Whoa. up smash. Good up smash. Two popcorns really got a read on his move movements. Yeah. I don't mind that it has invincibility. It's just it has invincibility, which is weird. Really? I was expecting a spike there. Maybe he just wants to be safe here. Dash attack. Huh? Wow. Normally when I see Pelotena do a landing forward air, dash attack comes right after for the combo. Listen, we got to be unexpected here in this matchup. It was a true combo. You don't, who cares if you're expected? Yeah, you got to mix it up. Wah. For the people at home. Back here. Nice stall. Trying to catch that back here. Ooh. Oh. Lots of back airs. Yep, the supersonic trying to close this out with a back air. <laughs> That's really funny because I was out of range of get. <gasps> There's your town and city, by the way. There we go. There is your town. Do not, ladies and gentlemen, do not leave town open for Sonic. Never. Because truthfully, this could go really south for Popcorn. Yeah, Popcorn needs to close this out pretty much right now. If he gets caught with a spin dash combo near the ledge at like 40 starting, he could die. Oh no. All right. Right there, you can see dash attack stuffing out spins. Oh, and right that's it. it. I like what he did there. And I'll explain it when it comes up. Yes. Yeah, let's go to that last uh, stock right there. Hey, Devin, give me that last replay. Oh, got you. Okay, so right here, right? Right. Let's see what's happening. Okay, he's going to grab the ledge, right? Right. And the way two popcorn moves right here, he's like, ah, uh, uh, no, you know what? Never mind. Spooter, Spooter already committed to his move. Never mind. Oh, you thought you Because it looks like, oh, I'm going to commit to back air to, you know, get you scared of doing any ledge options that don't move you off the ledge. And then he gets in place for the back row. Uh, but it's all for naught because Spooder Man chose his option. I mean, Sonic. Spooder Man. I'm Spooder looking Man. at his in game tank. Because Super Sonic chose his option before Two Popcorn even got into position for the back air. Yeah. To be fair, though, his option was good for baiting out a ledge roll. Yeah. So he was in position to get that punish anyway. All right. It looks like Two Popcorn. What we got here? Behind here. Now, this, is, now. this is an interesting choice because... This is a very strong Palutena stage. I wouldn't say not a bad stage for Sonic either, but you're right. Strong I know. for Palut. But to be fair, Town is also strong for Palutena too. Yes. Like, I think Sonic gets more out of Town than Palutena does, but Palutena definitely benefits from that stage. All right. Not getting too framed there. Catching the roll in. And two popcorn looking confident starting off this game three. Indeed. Game four. One of the big draws of this stage in town and city, aside from the nonsense that they have normally, is uh, their platforms are very high off the ground. So if you're playing a character who can, who needs like extra landing mix-ups, these stages give you those high platforms to just fast fall to them, put up your shield real fast, and there you go. You just got out of the juggle. Yeah. Supersonic trying to try and pressure with this forward smash. It is free wow. of space. Oh. Oh. Two popcorn doing a good job of just DIing out. I will also say this. Big... Never mind. <laughs> I'm sorry. What were you gonna say? Nothing important. Okay. I All wasn't right. commentators cursing him, but every uh -huh. time I try to like say things, deaths happen. You're like, yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Oh, the moment has passed. Well, what I was saying is, when you're fighting Sonic, because I've been experimenting with this fighting a whole bunch of different Sonics, mm -hmm. against Sonic Spin Dash and Spin Charge, SDI actually helps a lot more than you'd expect. Really? Because you can sometimes get through Sonic as he passes you, or in some cases fly too far away from him to follow up with attacks. Oh. It's not consistent. Sometimes Sonic will just get you anyway in spite of the SDI, but I've been finding myself slipping out of Sonic combos more often than not. And I'm saying this because I know top players don't do these things because they're bad. Oh, call them out, John. They're all bad. All they do is their strong set play and hard reads. <sighs> They need to be wiggling their control sticks to get out of a combo better. Yeah, soon, soon you'll win a major. No, I won't. And then that's the same speech I want to hear on oh. the mic. Oh, it's you win. Sonic back air. Not getting a kill, I'm surprised. 
know, I think just wasn't confident enough to challenge uh, two popcorn off stage. Oh my god, yes! Finally gets a kill there with the forward air. When Sonic's home gets extra shield, you do have enough time to do a rising aerial out of shield if it makes contact. I'm surprised we didn't get an up air. I feel like that would have taken it. Uh, I don't know. It may not have made contact in that situation. Mm. All right, we got spin, spin. All right. See, now we're dealing with the, the Sonic weakness. Jesus Christ. Oh my goodness. We're dealing with a known weakness of Sonic's. If he goes down in stocks... How does he make it back? Honestly, it's like, oh, how the turntables. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, the stall with the spin dash, unfortunately, was just too much and gets caught by the explosive flame. Because there's a reason why Sonic runs away from you. It's not just because he wants to play his bait and punish game. It's because... Oh, and the back air. A 3-1 nice. victory over Super Sonic. Two popcorn takes it. Yeah, Super Sonic, not too happy with that. Um, uh, you guys all right? That was three one, wasn't it? I'm yeah, like, I was pretty sure. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. There we okay, there we go. Yay. Did I win? Yeah. Did I win? You won. You yeah. won, bro. It's all good. You got three, bro. Congratulations. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> they were a little confused. I don't think Popcorn expected to win that set. He's like, did I do it? All right, let's get some replays. Yeah, uh, yeah. Show me them replays. I want to see the confused look on their face. <laughs> Not that I, I have yeah, too I much. should have clipped that, honestly. Aww. Not that I have too much to say about these replays, but, you know, catching it off air, very nice. Yeah, just some really good tech chasing here. Dash Tupac just playing it so well. Dash attack showing that it can beat those spin tags. Right, that we what got. we see here. I very think nice. Supersonic should have done that a lot more, just run off and forward air. It was probably, like, his one of the best choices you can do off stage against any character. I agree. It may not be completely desired, though, because Palutena's do like to just do their up B from above the ledge. Yeah. And Two Popcorn was going for pressure there, so it was the right moment there. Back air. Yeah. Ah, uh, Super Sonic just being like... Yeah. See that back air. See, that was when... If we can actually go to the beginning wait, wait, of wait. that stock... I just want to... Yeah. Palutena. Right? <laughs> just there super happy. One second. Yeah, Swiss has something to say about the beginning, so go for yeah, it. Oh, no, just, I want to see my man. He's oh, just like, huh? Good. <laughs> I, I win? Oh. I won. Right, because Devin likes to take that last <laughs> replay after the fist bump. And, I'd be uh, making fun of them. Of yeah. course. No, All but right, what happened here was a Supersonic thinking that he was going to actually go lower, you know. Yeah, just that's back. the exact situation. Yeah. He goes there, but I think the problem is, it, you know, kind of goes with the whole idea of it's really hard to challenge a Palu offstage. Like, not only that he went too low, right? But and it's on, also that Palu does have the, you know, the teleports. And so on it just makes of, it invincible. On top of all of this, mm -hmm. let's continue. Yes. Boing. Yeah. Didn't have a, didn't have a chance enough to air dodge back yeah, he wasn't, the stage. He wasn't very close to the ledge, but he didn't use his double jump yet. He just did it early. Oh. Weird. Could have mixed it up a little bit better then. But anyway, next.